Good morning, everyone. It is Annie Poirier from Shaping Perspectives back here with another AHA today. Um, so most of you know I have kind of a morning routine that has really been helpful in my life. Uh, it started with actually only 10 minutes, and you probably heard about that last year. And if you're new to this community, you're realizing that, um, good morning, Angela, that uh, that's part of what I do is I take some time every morning and just you know do something. And it has gotten a little bit more fine tuned for me and I really enjoy my morning, my, my morning period of time. And so this morning I was doing morning pages and that comes from uh, The Artist's Way. It's a book and it's just stream of conscious writing that you do in the morning. And so I was doing my writing this morning and I actually am gonna share some of my, my writing for, for you and what the three pages the morning pages are are just stream of conscious writing. So it's very much like meditation or letting your brain just kind of go. So I want to read this because I thought as I wrote it, it was very important for myself to realize and also to, um, to share with you. So here I go. So this is my stream of conscious writing. And I start out, just so you know, um, with this, the, I have no idea what I, what I, um, conscious stream of thoughts, what I'm thinking. I have no idea what that is. But then I go on to say, it was great to talk to Martha about, and so this is my friend Martha, um, about my high, own highs and lows. She was so helpful in opening the door to see how beautiful all our emotions are and how it is okay to experience all of them. So feeling angry does not make you a bad person. That society, right? If you're angry, then or or is something that sits in me, like I'm wrong and I shouldn't be angry. Um, so so feeling angry does not make you a bad person. Being sad does not make you depressed or need fixing. Big one, right? Um, any kind of emotion doesn't need fixing. This life will be full of emotions, all wonderfully placed throughout our lives. It is a, it is. Um, the wonder and joy of love that sets us up for extreme pain and grief and loss. So if we can't love so much, we can't hurt so bad. Um, sorry, let's get back to my place. Uh, sets us up for extreme. Um, it is the anger that creates this awareness for peace and contentment. Without one, you don't re really get to experience the other. So I'm able to open my heart and my head to the gratitude for all the emotions that move through, through me. How brilliant is that? So I'm gonna stop there and I kind of explained a little bit more there, but I wanted to share it because I thought for me it just popped up. And Martha, I call my head coach. So she's um, a person that I've worked with for, for quite a while. And um, she, she is, she's kind of, she's my coach. Um, I coach women and I have my own coach and I have other coaches too. So I wanted to share that today because I thought it was so profound in my own head. And so that when things come to you and trigger you, how wonderful is that to have that emotion come up? And how wonderful is that, that we can look at that in a different light and say, oh, thanks for showing up. And how can I even kind of gather and look at this emotion from a different perspective? We have, uh, a series of experiences that tell us that certain emotions mean certain things and these are just belief systems and this is what we do like in a VIP experience we try to break apart some of these belief systems so that we can actually ha fall in love right with some of the experiences that we have that we might not have ever fallen in love with before so that's my aha for today thanks for um, letting me read my journal to you uh, I don't people in there, lock and key usually. But I thought that was a great thing to, to share today. Have a fabulous day. If you're interested in um, thinking about, Angela did a VIP uh, last year. And so if you're interested in what that is, I do have some open slots to have a chat about a VIP. So, um, and that's a, a pretty amazing life-changing experience and we do have some opens openings this year so i'll share that and you can have a conversation if that you think that might be something you'd be interested in or you know somebody that might be interested have a wonderful friday
and we'll see you soon.